Hi, Chris Walls from Second Swing. We're with Srixon Golf today in Mission Viejo, California. I've got Zach Oakley with me. Zach, good to see you. Good to see you too. We're having a lot of fun today. We're out here testing new product. We're going to talk specifically about irons right now. We've got 2018 Z series irons, the 785, the 585, and then the U85 utility. Uh, got to hit all three. Came away impressed with all three. You guys have done some nice work here. Yeah, no, we're really excited about these. Um, you know, they're kind of an evolution. Uh, you know, Srixon's always been really well known for its irons. Um, so these are a nice evolution of the last generation. Um, we've got some new technologies. You were talking about um, on the 585 how you kind of felt like the ball was holding on to the face a little bit more. You know, talk us through that feeling a little bit. Yeah, the 585, you know, is. All right, I'm done. <laughs> yeah, they really, yeah, that's right on the nose. It's so long, it's just amazing for a club that feels that good and is that compact at a dress. Really looks like a true player's iron, but the launch is incredible, but the ball speed and the distance are what stand out. You know, along with incredible feel, a lot of times, you know, you can find an iron that will hit it a long way and hit it a mile in the air, but it's not gonna feel very good. Mm -hmm. Not the case here at all. And compared to the 565, uh, which I had a chance to test when it came out, this feels a little bit softer and it feels like the ball just stays on that face just that little split second longer before it explodes. And I know that there's some new technology that's sort of promoting that feel. Yeah, so in, these, in this generation, we have what's called a speed groove. Um, and that is that you know CNC milled cavity that goes around that uh, face insert. Um, and so that just gives it a little more face flex. So you're probably feeling the ball holding on to the face a little bit longer and you're gonna get more ball speed because of that. And especially if you hit it out towards the toe a little bit, you know, you're not quite catching it square, you know, that's, that's gonna help you maintain that and not come up short. Yeah, and you know, it was really interesting. I'm somebody who has played uh, a combo set of the mm -hmm. 765 and 965 irons and to me it address with both the new 785 and 585 they're a little bit smaller the 585 almost looks like my 765 mm -hmm. mid and long irons and the 785 almost looks like my 965 short irons they're really beautiful sort of streamlined from where you were and I think players are going to really enjoy that. Yeah, and that's, you know, one of the things that makes Strix on Irons, you know, so popular is that they really do have a lot of the forgiveness in terms of performance that a lot of our competitors don't, uh, but they kind of maintain the shape of a player that a player really prefers. You know, the 585s, for instance, they're a game improvement iron because they have game improvement technologies, but they don't look like a game improvement iron. And I think that's why a lot of players gravitate towards those because they look so great at a dress, but you're getting the same sort of performance benefits that you would from, you know, something that looked a little bit bulkier. Yeah, absolutely. And, and both of them feel outstanding. I thought the, the 785 felt even a little bit softer than the 765s. Um, I know they're milled or forged from 1020 carbon steel, which is a premium material, super soft. The feel is outstanding. The acoustics, the feedback you get, outstanding as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually didn't know that we could make them any softer, but uh, they definitely feel softer than, than the previous version. Yeah, and I think it's also worth uh, pointing out that one of the reasons these irons have been so popular is the, the V-Sole, which really gives players great turf interaction. This is a new VT Tour Sole. I'll let you maybe explain kind of what that is, but again, just the, the turf interaction for somebody who's shallow like me or somebody else who's even a little bit steeper, you take bigger divots, you were hitting them, you love them as well. Really outstanding. Yeah, so one of, I would say one of the bigger engines that you know have driven the Srixon performance in terms of irons is that Tour VT Sole. There's a little more bounce on the leading edge so you can get through that turf um, and it cuts through a little bit faster and there's also a trailing edge so as you exit it doesn't really catch. Um, and what that does, you know, for a tour player, you know, who's always striking the ball first, as they go through it feels so much better because there's less friction. For golfers like yourself or myself who may maybe catch it a little fat from <laughs> time to time, um, what that leading edge does is it allows you to actually cut through the turf a little better so you do actually you're actually getting more ball speed because, you know, with an iron that doesn't have a Tour VT sole, 
you're not getting that leading edge, that bounce isn't interacting the same. So you're going to lose ball speed, lose distance, and uh, ultimately come up short from your target. Yeah, and uh, you know, moving on, I want to talk about the utility iron. It's been a huge success for you in both the U45 and U65, now U85. It was a standout for me today, um, especially the two iron and the three iron, you know, for me as a something as an alternative to a hybrid, which maybe I don't always get along with, or a long iron, mm -hmm. which doesn't give me the playability I need. Those were incredible in terms of performance. Yeah, we're really excited about the U85. Um, you know, Strix on utility irons, this year they've been the number one utility iron on tour. A um, lot of tour players that even aren't on our staff are asking about them. Um, what's really new with these this year is that we're actually offering them from a two iron through a six iron. Um, which, is, which is really cool because you, now you can combo those with your 5 Series or your 7 Series. So if a golfer you know, wants to get you know, a little more forgiveness in those long irons at 4 or 5, you can do that now. Um, and that's you know, something we're really proud of and, and really excited to be able to offer. Yeah, and I mean, that's you know, for, for that sort of mid-higher handicap player who needs the distance, needs the forgiveness, needs the launch you know, to maybe play a four, five, six in the utility and go to the 585s mm -hmm. and seven through pitching wedge to get that sort of performance in clubs that look and feel that good is, is pretty rare. Yeah, and I think you bring up, you know, the look. One of the things we did was we kind of made the, the look at a dress a little more iron-like. So you're not, especially in the longer or the higher lofted irons where they're going to be blended more with some of those combo sets, you're not going to look down and go, well, this looks really bulky. It doesn't. It looks, it kind of maintains the whole Strixon family's uh, look at a dress. Yeah, it'll blend in nicely with the irons. And, and I think the single biggest takeaway that I want to mention from this, and I, I mentioned this earlier as well, but it, it, it's important, is the fact that a lot of times with the hollow design clubs, there's a real sort of clicky, kind of hard feel at impact, and this feels just like the other irons. It's super solid, super muted, and soft, and, and it's, it, it feels outstanding. Yeah, similar to the 585, it had, you know, it's forged from 1020 carbon steel, and it does have that SUP10 face insert, so you're gonna get more ball speed. Um, but you're right, they don't, they're not, they don't sound clicky. They're very um, smooth and, and kind of soft coming off the face, which is, uh, you know, one of the reasons why they've been so popular. Yeah, no doubt about it. Zach, thanks for letting us hit them today. Good Absolutely. looking stuff. We appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks.